Yechezkeel, Ezekiel 26. And it came to pass in the eleventh year, in the first day of the month, that the word of Yahuwah came unto me, saying, Son of Adam, because that Sor has said against Yerushalayim, Aha, she is broken, that was the gates of the people, she is turned unto me. I shall be replenished, now she is laid waste. Therefore thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, I am against you, O Sor, and will cause many nations to come up against you as the sea causes his waves to come up. And they shall destroy the walls of Sor and break down her towers. I will also scrape her dust from her and make her like the top of a rock. It shall be a place for the spreading of nets in the midst of the sea. For I have spoken it, says Adonai Yahuwah, and it shall become a spoil to the nations. And her daughters, which are in the field, shall be slain by the sword, and they shall know that I am Yahuwah. For thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, I will bring upon Sor Nebuchadni Satsar, king of Babel, a king of kings from the north, with horses and with chariots and with horsemen and companies and much people. He shall slay with the sword your daughters in the field, and he shall make a fort against you, and cast a mount against you, and lift up the buckler against you, and he shall set engines of war against your walls, and with his axes he shall break down your towers. By reason of the abundance of his horses, their dust shall cover you. Your walls shall shake at the noise of the horsemen, and of the wheels, and of the chariots, when he shall enter into your gates, as men enter into a city wherein is made a breach. With the hoofs of his horses shall he tread down at all your streets. He shall slay your people by the sword, and your strong garrisons shall go down to the ground, and they shall make a spoil of your riches, and make a prey of your merchandise, and they shall break down your walls, and destroy your pleasant houses, and they shall lay your stones and your timber and your dust in the midst of the water. And I will cause the noise of your songs to cease, and the sound of your harps shall be no more heard. And I will make you like the top of a rock. You shall be a place to spread nets upon. You shall be built no more. For I, Yahuwah, have spoken it, says Adonai Yahuwah. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah to Sor, Shall not the isles shake at the sound of your fall, when the wounded cry, when the slaughter is made in the midst of you? Then all the princes of the sea shall come down from their thrones, and lay away at their robes, and put off at their broidered garments. They shall clothe themselves with trembling, they shall sit upon the ground and shall tremble at every moment and be astonished at you. And they shall take up a lamentation for you and say to you, How are you destroyed that was inhabited of seafaring men, the renowned city, which was strong in the sea? She and her inhabitants which caused their terror to be on all that haunt it. Now shall the isles tremble in the day of your fall. Yea, the isles that are in the sea shall be troubled at your departure. For thus says Adonai Yahuwah, When I shall make you a desolate city, like the cities that are not inhabited, 
when I shall bring up eth the deep upon you, and great waters shall cover you, when I shall bring you down with them that descend eth into the pit, with the people of old time, and shall set you in the low parts of the earth, in places desolate of old, with them that go down eth to the pit, that you be not inhabited, and I shall set glory in the land of the living. And, rather, I will make you a terror, and you shall be no more. Though you be sought for, yet shall you never be found again, says Adonai Yahuwah.